On Saturday, I'm going to Bali for two weeks. What? Is that new? Use this moment when you're in an empty gym to practice by yourself. If you ever make it to a contest, you could think back to this moment where nobody's around and there's no distractions, just you in the room. I just gotta walk in the to always in the Locked in the path, never getting off track. So it's basically an empty gym. Uh, we got one dude in here, but we could probably get him out. Uh, other than that though, I'm gonna try to dunk so fucking hard that it just breaks every bone in my body, including my kneecaps, because the travel of the velocity through my wrists travels down and just bolts out, you know? That's the goal, and uh, yeah, I'm gonna try to dunk so fucking hard, it's just stupid. Yo, so my hamstring's actually feeling really healthy. It's getting better. The foam rolling's helping. It's still taking time. But since I've been jumping a lot more, I can add more workouts. I'm doing a lot more upper body. I woke up at 178 today, so feeling with thickness, I feel strong jumping. But since I can jump a lot more, I can work out a lot more without feeling like I'm getting too sluggish and too heavy and too blocky. But I like working out upper body. It feels like when I have more strength, and I can jump through it, I feel stronger, and it feels like that force helps me jump higher. So that's where I'm at with my journey. But right now, it's about getting healthy, kind of getting my whole body strong, as strong as I possibly can, but not like a strength phase. It's different because I'm kind of just doing maintenance and upper body strength, but uh, my, my focus, my focus is jumping. Yo, I feel thick, but I feel strong. Sluggish and thick and horrible cardio. It's completely empty. You're gonna get me, see me get super hype because I made progress. I don't need anybody in the gym. Of course, I love it. It's a lot more fun, but the camera helps. If you have a camera, record yourself, post it online. That shit gets me hype because I know people are gonna watch it and it's fun to see my own progress and to help inspire other people. So that's how I get hype when I'm in a gym. Plus, it's just fun. I love it. Even if I wasn't recording, I would just love the action. So. Find something that you're passionate about because when you do it for no reason, that's how you know you love it. I forgot to mention, in between this day and my last upper body big day, I did some jumping just to kind of tell my body I'm going to be using those noom foul muscles explosively and kind of translate it. So today, super fresh, feeling really strong, a little sluggish, just a little heavier, but I feel really good, really good energy and really good blood flow. Like nothing feels sore, I feel great. Another thing about a good, whoa, another great thing about the empty gym is you can practice a visualization, either to get a crowd to get you hype, or you can on the flip side of it, use this moment when you're in an empty gym to practice by yourself. If you ever make it to a contest, you can think back to this moment where nobody's around and there's no distractions, just you in the room, and you can have fun with it and enjoy that moment. Two sides of the same coin.
still going gradual. No walk off on him, Steve. Mentally, I want to do a windmill. I mean, whew. so I want to do a windmill, but mentally I'm not that aggressive right now. So I'm just going to throw a couple more really high ones to go get it, get back in the aggression. It's been a few weeks since I've really gone hard. I've only been had a few hard sessions where I really go attack mode hard. So I'm trying to get back that to do a full aggression because it really takes mental psychosis to go hard without any consequences. So I'm getting there. Technique is out the window with the two-hand dribble dunk. Gotta bring it back. For those that, those, those that have been watching for a while, you know it's what I struggle with, but I'm gonna come back better than ever. I'm not coming back from anything, it's just I get rusty. Oh yeah. I think it's time for a little distance. So I'm fucking amped, my adrenaline's through the roof because this crowd is too wild, so I gotta try to keep it calm. But honestly, I'm super amped. My heart rate's going crazy, a lot of caffeine pre-workout even. Whew. I'm gonna try to take a breath because I wanna go nuts, and I'm just going hard, so I wanna have a little bit more focus. I feel too fast to even handle my jump, so I gotta find the optimal speed. <laughs> On Saturday, I'm going to Bali for two weeks. What? Fantastic day for being a thick boy. I feel really good about the jumps. Starting to die out a little bit, but worked on a lot today. Feel really great about my jumps. Super strong. Hamstring still in the works, but as soon as I get back to more technique work and get used to this speed, I'm gonna be really good at landing dunks. Feeling really good about it. Is that new? about dumb, but I'll show you I'm something. Ready, man. You a windmill, I'll do a windmill for you. Don't do this so hard. That's all. That's the only way I know how. <laughs> 